talented artists from around the country chosen to participate in National Young Arts Week. It's a week of master classes, exhibitions, public performances, and life-changing experiences for high school students. And CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo has the story. With a new year comes the opportunity to see new talent. It's National Young Arts Week, as finalists ages 15 to 18 come together from around the country here to South Florida to learn and perform. Young Arts is now in its 39th year. We receive over 7,000 applications from all over the country every year, and we have 148 finalists with us from 30 states. And it's really exciting. They're coming from 10 different disciplines, so all of the performing arts, writing, visual art, design arts, film. Rebecca was a 2,000 Young Arts winner, and now serves as a senior director of artistic programs. I received a letter from them 20 years ago and it told me I was an artist. It gave me the validation to pursue a career in the arts and a life in the arts. And being able to come back now and offer that same opportunity to the next gener generation of artists is amazing. Here at the Miami City Ballet, dancers are learning from master teachers and former alumni. They will perform on Wednesday evening at the New World Center. Vernon Scott heads up the selection panel for the dancers. This is the moment where they're finding themselves and becoming in an artist that we will see later. This is the beginning of their journey and Young Arts follows them the whole way. 16-year-old Kaylee Wardenstoff is a contemporary dancer from Wellington, while Rush Carson is studying choreography at the New World School in Miami. Is it intimidating? Is it embracing? Is it everything above? The concept of it was intimidating, but once you're here, everyone's so supportive. It's just, it's kind of a dream as an artist to be interacting with all these different art forms. It opens so many doors for like colleges. It gives you like an extra like push, um, and it helps you realize that like you actually want to pursue dance. Like now I'm like really want to pursue dance and like I can't wait to go to college and expand like my knowledge of dance and everything. Artists such as Kerry Washington, Viola Davis and Josh Groban are just some notable young arts alumni. The program is all about the future. I think the most important thing that we do is cultivate the next generation of thinkers and creatives who really will be creating the world that we're going to be living in for the future. National Young Arts Week is on through Sunday with performances happening every night. Most of those performances are on over at the New World Center on Miami Beach. The others are at the Young Arts Building in Miami. For more information, log on to our website at cbsmiami.com. I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. That is so cool and nice to hear that they're supportive because that can be such a competitive environment. No doubt about that and they're so motivated and so focused already at a young age. Yeah, amazing love to see them in action. Love it. And that is CBS 4 News at 530. Here's what's next.